Hallelujah. You may be seated. Thank you. You believe God will manifest His strength in your weakness. Amen. That is your hand if you believe that. Once we believe this, you will not have reason to condemn yourself. No condemnation for you. You know what weakness means? Weakness can be any. This is what Paul Apostle said. When I'm weak, then I'm strong. So now you believe that. What else again? And that is why you are here. Imagine you left your country two days, three days on the journey. And at last you are here. And you are still thinking of your weakness again. Uh, because I'm a smoker. God will not answer me. Uh, because I'm drunk. God will not answer me. Because of this, God will not answer me. Ah, if you have not prepared in advance, you will not come here. The Lord God has prepared you. Amen. No one come to Jesus without preparation. That is what the Bible says. Say, no one can say Jesus is law, except by what? By preparation by the Holy Ghost. He must prepare you. He must make you to believe. He must cook you. It's not a human. God is spirit. And it's what you must be spirit as well. If you know what tells you to be here, it's not just one day you think of this place. For many years, you are planning to be here and keep failing. Amen. Those whom the Lord prepared, stay with the Lord. Amen. When the Lord prepared you to go a place, you will not even want to let people know because of discouragement. It's like a fasting. When God prepare you to fast, you must go and fast. Because God is final. Amen. God prepare you in advance to be here. The very moment you thought of coming here, you may start having a nightmare, an attack. The attack will speed up. You say, ah, what is wrong? What is wrong? If the Lord had not prepared you to be here with those attacks, with those discouragements, with those negative way, with those what you have seen and all of that, able to get money, flight ticket, 
you will not be here. Those whom the Lord prepare, those whom he save and protect. So this is why I'm saying, if the Lord had prepared you in advance to be here, first is ready to manifest its strength in your weakness. Amen. Where you are weak, you are strong. Amen. That is the first thing. That is God's preparation. When you see someone who say uh, after COVID, say no, 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 I don't want them to touch me. No, no, you know the Lord has not prepared. The first thing you will see if you are prepared to be here, the Lord will manifest his strength in your weakness. Amen. That is the first thing. So this is why I'm asking you, are you ready? So that's it. Where you are weak, you are strong. So thank you. Thank you, Viva at home. You listen to what we are saying here. That for those the Lord had prepared, He manifested His word in their world, in their witness. So whatever area of your witness. That is the consign of God. That is who? Consign of God. Leave it for God. It is not about your weakness, success, healing. It's not about your weakness. Deliverance is not about your weakness. I'm a smoker. He will not hear me. No. I'm a drunker. He will not hear me. No. It is not about your work, about your weakness. Healing is not about your weakness. Deliverance is not about your weakness. So now you have no excuse. Your availability. Are you available? I'm available. Here I am. Here I am. Say to the Lord, I can hear you. I can hear you. I can hear you. That is all. That is all. Here I am, Lord. I'm available. Here I am. Whatever your weakness, here I am. He made you feet at the cross. Here I am, Lord. Whatever you are, here I am. Is God of creation. So your weaknesses, whatever you think is barrier now, it's not a barrier. You just say, here I am. It is not about your war. It's not about your weakness. Be available. Be ready. Here I am. Change me. Here I am. Save me. Here I am, heal me. That is all. That should be your prayer. When you just sit and say, here I am, heal me. Forget about anything. Where you are coming from does not matter. Here I am, heal me. Here I am, save me. Here I am, bless me. Forget about, uh, I'm a smoker, I'm this, I'm that. If that spirit of smoking has so much influence and power on you, it will not allow you to come here. His influence has cut since you enter. You are here by God's invitation. Amen. That's all. You are here by God's word. Yes. You are here by his invitation. If you are not qualified, you will not receive. You have received the invitation. That's why you are here. Begin to talk in your spirit. Here I am, Lord. Here I am. 
Forget about whatever you are, whatever your weakness, whatever your weakness, forget about that. Whatever you think are not going to make you qualify, no, put it behind. Here I am, bless me. Here I am, save me. Here I am, heal me. Here I am, deliver me. Here I am. This is all you want to hear from you. You must be sincere. You must say this with all your heart. You must mean it, what you are saying. Mean it, mean it with all your heart. Here I am, Lord, save me. Here I am, bless me. Here I am, deliver me. Simple, this is all Jesus wants from you. Whatever your background, whether you are from other worship or whatever day you are not a believer, that is not an issue. Begin to fire on, fire on, fire on, minute, 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 minute. If the Lord wants somebody, here I am. They was all over the world. I know you are available. You are fit. That is why you are under the influence of this telecast. You are qualified. That is why you are under the influence of this telecast. Ordinarily, it's not possible for you to sit down and be watching Money TV and abandon every other thing. If you are not qualified, you cannot watch. You are watching Money TV by God's invitation. Begin to fire on in your spirit. Here I am, Lord. Here I am, Lord. Heal me. Here I am. Save me. Here I am. Bless me, Lord. Here I am. Deliver me. This is what Jesus wants to hear from you. Whatever your weakness, whatever the barrier, whatever you think can be the obstacle to your blessing, no, 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 put it behind you. Don't forget, forgive them. This includes you. This war, this includes you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name.